We on? All right. Hello and welcome everybody to the 2024 Pokemon Speedruns Marathon. We're going to have a little preview show today. I'm TI Kevin 83, your host, and I'm joined by Primal Pizza. Hello. And Blue Magma. What's up, every- oh, sorry. Yo, what's up, everybody? <laughs> All good, Blue Magma. And we've got them because they are runners in the marathon today, and we're going to go through the schedule and give you some of our highlights and uh, recaps of all of these amazing uh, info we've got from the PR team created over the last couple of weeks here from the Twitter. So uh, I'm just going to start out right immediately here with our first runner, Primal Pizza, who is on the pre-show. Primal, tell us a little bit about your Any% percent Glitchless run. Well, I've been running yellow for about like three years now, a little over three years. Uh, it's a really fun game. I've been really focusing on it for the past like six months or so. Any percent glitchless lately. I've been doing some NSC as well. I think uh, I think yellow overall gets kind of a bad rap compared to red, but I think yellow is definitely a very interesting speed run in its own right. And I hope to kind of show off some of the stuff that makes it special today. And and uh, Primal, will you be doing the sort of low XP strats that we had routed back in the day, or are there different XP route strats that are currently used, especially within a race setting? I mean, race, uh, the main thing I'm going to do is get Gentleman Candy. Mm, uh, yeah. Because that just, that makes Surge free and Fly Split pretty much completely free, besides Fortune Thrash Girl. Uh, but that's really the only kind of experience deviation I'm going to do from any percent glitchless. Just the normal the normal route. Awesome. Thanks, Primal. So after our intro run from Primal Pizza, we have a three-way race of Pokemon Let's Go uh, Pikachu and Eevee from Randall Eats Cheese, J Tattles, and Razor's Edge. Randall is uh, quite the paint memester. We have a great Keck Lava uh, post on the Twitter from that. And he was also an acapella singer in college. So uh, you might not have known that about uh, Randall. And then we have uh, Spider C and Dynam and New Amber and Etiquette doing a four way race of the Switch game Pokemon Scarlet and Violet treasures of ruin dlc at least i remember, I remember correctly that's a dlc for the pokemon it's crowd. not a it's not a dlc oh it's not a dlc it's okay. in the base game you just have to like pull out there's like stakes in the game you got to pull out in order gotcha. to get these legendaries and that's why i have co-commentators because i might not know everything <laughs> i don't so, know anything uh, about the speed run itself but <laughs> i'm excited to see that one and if i just uh look here we had some great posts uh, from them, especially also I mentioned Razor's Edge in the Let's uh, Go. Uh, they had a great uh, picture from a Twins uh, baseball game outing with a bunch of PSR friends. So I love to see that involvement and support of everyone at the uh, meetups we do. So after that, then we have uh, Etiquette, who I just mentioned is participating in the Scarlet Violet race. He is doing a solo run of Detective Pikachu Returns, any percent. And this is a Switch game. It's a follow-up to the 3DS Detective Pikachu game and kind of wraps up some of that storyline. After that, we have the first run of our Saturday morning. Omega 44 will be showing us Pokemon White 2 Baton Pass Challenge Mode. And uh, that one, it's, uh, it's just going to be the single solo run from omega 44 then we have a short station break overnight before in the morning we pick up at 7 30 a.m with a race of pokemon battle revolution between rda and scoagogo and those are some real uh long-term names i I, i'm gonna just read this blurb in full i did from uh rda's thing here for uh uh pokemon battle revolution Kachow! Racing against RDA in Battle Revolution is Pixar Cars DS runner Skoa Gogo. Skoa is a seven-year PSR veteran and is proud of his 309 White 2 run 
and he recently climbed a glacier while on vacation. So uh, I love the variety we have in our posts here from everyone. So uh, I also for RDA wrote after white two this Saturday, crack open a PBR. If you're legal drinking age as <laughs> RDA takes a crack at racing Pokemon battle revolution. Uh, RDA or yes, RDA is also getting married next year. So that's the, our morning for Saturday. And then after that, we will have a live Pokemon Speedruns TV podcast episode. And after that, we have Garfield the Lightning doing Pokemon Infinity any percent with no speed ups. After Garfield the Lightning takes on Pokemon Infinity, we have a co op archipelago run from Pro Poke Noob and Broken But Alive. This is estimated at four and a half hours, so we're going to get a lot of archipelago content. And Blue Magma, I think you said you've done some archipelago yourself here. Yes, I did a. Um, I've done a couple Pokemon archipelagos and some other ones. Um, they're really cool. So, for those that don't know, uh, an archipelago is this kind of software that can combine items from games and randomize them together. So you might need the Sylph Scope in Pokemon Red, but that might be behind Brawly's Gym Badge in Pokemon Emerald, for example. And then something you need in Emerald, like the, I don't know, a certain badge might be behind the, might be behind another badge in Red or in the Safari Zone in Red. So you've got to go all around, not just to find your own items like a normal randomizer, but you got to help your teammate as well. So there's a lot of interesting teamwork that goes on in these runs. Yeah, personally, I want to do one where I create something in Factorio and then it lets me fight a Kingdom Hearts 2 boss. And then <laughs> yeah. uh, unlocking that lets me uh, beat a, a new gym or something. Like the, the, the breadth of things you can combine together is awesome. But for the Pokemon Marathon, we're going to be combining Pokemon Red and Pokemon Emerald across this archipelago. After the Archipelago run, Saturday night, Iron will give us Pokemon Aquamarine. And do you guys know off the top of your head, is this all part of a meme block on Saturday here? I believe the meme block is after, I think it's on Sunday is the meme okay. block. Okay, so uh, we are not into the, we're not deep into the memes, we're just in the ROM hacks right now. Yep, yep. With Pokemon <laughs> Aquamarine. Really? And, this uh, on some meme block. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, even Poco, even Yellow, any percent glitchless can be a meme to speedrun, right? <laughs> oh, of course. <laughs> so uh, Iron will show us Pokemon Aquamarine that Saturday night, and then after that, we have Pokemon Infinite Fusion beat gold from Gary J Games and Alimra. Uh, really excited about that one. Alimra gave us a great shot for the Twitter, and uh, that's going to take us into Sunday morning. And you'll see me commentating actually a race of Pokemon Red and Green Any Percent NSC. The the original Japanese Red Green has different no save corruption strats from the American uh, release, so that's going to be fun to see in Sunday morning. And then Cousin will show us Pokemon Emerald Battle Dome level fifty at two fifteen a.m. And then we'll have another station break overnight before we get to Pokemon Rumble Blast from, I, uh, I believe that is, uh, actually, I'm not even going to attempt uh, One of them's Cotton. There's a couple different Japanese runners in our marathon, and I don't want to mistake one for the other. So I'll just say uh, one of them will be running for the Pokemon Rumble Blast any percent at 425 a.m. And then after that, we go to the only one who is really known for doing a lot of Coliseum runs. Uh, the only one will, will today be doing, uh, not today, but <laughs> for the marathon on Sunday, doing Mystery Dungeon Red Blue Rescue Team. Before then, around noon, we'll have a repeat of Iron and Fury ST, who was helping up uh, get us set up for the intro show here. They're doing a race of Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, no mount skips, no evolutions. And that'll be about four hours before we see Spider C. We mentioned Spider C earlier doing that four way race of Scarlet Violet Treasures of Ruin. Uh, Spider C will come back to do 
Isle of Armor alt main dub wool, and I think we have to be into the meme block then with dub wool. <laughs> After that, we see another repeat with Etiquette doing Let's Go EV one player one controller. And RDA, again, another repeat, lots of repeat runners from the marathon doing Rumble Bidoof percent on the Wii U, and that'll be around 9 30 p.m. Sunday night before we get to another station break break and then blue magma. If you want to give us a quick blurb about what you'll be doing Sunday night, just after 11 PM. Yeah. So this will kind of be like the, the end of the meme block, I guess, but there's already a glitchless soft lock percent in Sapphire shout outs to Ananan. He's done a lot of routing with that, but uh, with the new glitches that we showed off in the last marathon, uh, there's been a lot of developments for other kind of meme categories like glitched softlock percent. Um, it's basically twice as fast as the current glitchless softlock percent. So it's going to be a cool little exhibition of some of the glitches that you don't get to show off in any percent. I'm excited to see that. I'm always excited to see new stuff there, Blue Magma. So thank you so much for that update on that one. And that takes us to Monday, August 5, where we'll see Zach Attack 56. Play Poke Park 2 Wonders Beyond Any Percent. And that'll be about three hours. And that'll take us deep into the morning where Tora Knight overnight will show us Pokemon trading card game all battles single run. And if I remember correctly, I believe Tora Knight also plays the physical trading card game. So that will be great to see from Tora Knight. And then Blue Magma, you're coming back again at <laughs> 6 a.m. Ooh, yep. early wake up call after that 11 10 p.m uh gonna need a nap there i think uh, on that monday but <laughs> you're gonna yeah. like, catch them all in sapphire tell me about uh, that one yeah this is a this is a doozy it's a long one um so yeah if you're if you're american you know grab your your coffee um if you're in the the uk or europe you know you're kind of in a good time slot but um yeah feel free to just stop in and check out the the run whenever you're available because there's it's jam-packed with crazy strats um very crazy rng manipulations obviously you know you've got to catch every one percent encounter in the game um and then this is another example of there's a lot of interesting glitches that aren't really useful for any percent um but they're they make catching things a lot easier um and there are also some new any percent strats that are reflected in uh, this run, so there will be some never-before-seen uh, route updates to show off as well. Awesome. Thank you, Blue Magma. And that is a seven-hour run, so we will see most of the morning with Blue Magma on the PSR TV channel. And uh, running on GBI, always a fan of seeing that GBI is so useful for so many of our one- to three-generation Pokemon games. Then we'll see Fury East, uh, or is it Fury East or Fury ST? I, I needed to get to know Fury better here to know to know that name. Maybe none of us know. know. We'll, I don't we'll know. Check in on that one. <laughs> He's saying Fury East <laughs> full word. Fury East full word. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. We'll see Elite Four round three on Brilliant Diamond from Fury East for about five and a half hours, and that'll be the afternoon on Monday before we get to. The marathon closeout, uh, three-time Emmy-nominated T. Pat Thomas Patrick W. X. Uh, he is a weather reporter, if I remember correctly, out in Washington, and he will be doing an any percent run on the Switch of Pokemon Legends Arceus, and that will be about four hours. And then we will have the end of our marathon and we will have another rap show. So uh, send us clips on the Twitter uh, tweet at us. If you want to uh, get some clips into that wrap up show of uh, things you've enjoyed from, from throughout the marathon. Thank you so much for watching the intro show today. Thank you. Primal pizza and blue magma for squeezing in this quick intro show. And uh, I think that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy the marathon. <laughs>